Football fans tribe here with the interview Nigeria football fans after matches and we give you Nigeria football fan content back to back. So if you're new here, please don't beg, click that subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching. Yeah, I had sing that song. It don't happen. Fair, fair, fair. <laughs> fair. How you see the match? Well, the match did disappoint as you talk, I understand. I don't expect uh, Arsenal to lose this match like this. At least, if we were to give a fight here, at least maybe draw game, understand. This game should have been draw to give us a clear chance to be in the Champions League. You understand? But it don't happen, it don't happen. How we go do? We don't take as it happen. That's all. Was, was the red card the decider? Uh, that red card was very poor from the ref for me because if you watch the game very well, the way the way Song was playing on that game, he was not playing only the ball as well. He was playing with holding. He was not playing only the ball. So for him to play with holding, to be that he's fighting holding as well. And Hodi not go just day like that, they allowed him to fight now. He go fight back as well. So it was a very poor decision from the ref for me. Yeah. It was not a red card. Mm -hmm. It was not a red card, yes. But then he don't want holding like two to three times now. Then before he give him the yellow card, then to go show that somebody like that when no day on the ball. I mean, to me, I just talk my own opinion, but sure, you don't talk say the, the red card was poor. But without the red card, you feel say Arsenal go turn the result today? Uh without the red card, I believe say Arsenal is supposed to do something. Arsenal is supposed to win this game. Even if the red card no day, yeah. even we are one man a uh, 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 go down, we are supposed to still win the game. But with that red card, I think just shutting our our progress in the game. Yeah. So that red card is a very big block to us. It's the one that a big block that made us to go down to the game. Mm. This one is about the ref. This particular red card is all about the ref because the ref noticed that the game is about fight. You understand? They are fighting for this game. And that be now? Yes, now they are fighting about the game. So you won't just start throwing card in that game like that. You understand? Because this game is all about war. We are fighting for a purpose. It's a derby game and we are fighting for Champions League as well. So you won't see somebody marking someone with a, a strong method and you believe that the person is found the person. No. The person is trying to play the game as the game is. The game is a derby game. So you won't just start putting red card in the game just like that. So it was a very poor decision for me. Interesting now. And then um, Newcastle to play as long as Everton. Alongside Everton on the last day. And then uh, Tottenham to play Burnley and then Norwich. I want to know how confident you did now. The top four is it done, or if you say hopes did it? Well, if you look, if you look into uh, Tottenham's last two games, you find out that they are they have the green light to go forward. You understand? But I won't take it the fact that those teams are teams as well. They can as well fight for points. You understand? So I won't give them the whole green light as well. But it's a winning game for them. But for Arsenal, it's a winning game for us as well. Though it will be a bit tough. You understand? It will be a bit tough, but it's a winning game for Arsenal as well. So I believe. And I have the faith that Arsenal will succeed. Arsenal will make it to Champions League. Yeah. Yes, they will triumph towards the Champions League. They will win. They will win Newcastle and they will win Everton. <laughs> I promise you that you will check it out now. You will see it. <laughs> Interesting. But now the injuries to Gabriel and every other person, I, I don't know. What do you think will happen in that defence now? Uh, it's a big challenge. a big challenge because I observed that our defence is going down the way. understand. Yeah. It's a very big challenge to us. We have to work on that. And if our attack mind players can be scoring goals, as in be scoring goals, it will allow the defense, you know, before it goes ease them off normally. We have to work on our firing power. Our firing power needs to be sharp more because our defense is very weak. Because if they scores, if we know if they scores, then they go defend. You know, go fit, counter them, enter them again. But if we start to score them from beginning, it will give our defense hope, say yes. Even if they is conceived, we still have more goals ahead. So, but I believe that Arsenal defend, anyhow, they will do it. I believe we can still stand the games that are on our way coming. 